One of our heroes, one of our icons of broadcasting. Rowena Baird is joining me outside the residence of the Mbuli family. This is where Vuyo used to live. Uh, she's been chatting to us this morning. Just, uh, she's, uh, I'm not going to call her as family spokesperson. I'm calling her a family friend. That's what I'm going to do. Um, we, we were here from early this morning and uh, I thought that, I thought Monday was difficult, but, but I think today was even more difficult when Vuyo's body arrived here this morning. Leanne, I think today is the day of reckoning because it's the day when we lay Vuyo to rest, his final resting place who's going to be buried at the West Park Cemetery um, the Heroes Acre and I think quite rightly so yeah. you know Vuyo was a hero I mean just look at the outpouring of grief by South Africa in general mm. um, and I think what made him even more special is uh, his humility within this greatness yeah. you know Vuyo was approachable you could talk to him he was he was a person yeah. you know yeah. And he was one of the people, and that was what I think people recognized in him. Did you, did you ever expect, even when you, when you heard the news and everything was going to happen, did you expect what has happened this week? Did you, in, even in your wildest dreams, expect the reaction? Not to this magnitude. Definitely not to this magnitude. But, I mean, he was, he was, he was, he was a people's person. Yeah. Yeah. You know, and and uh, and and you and, and you know, I, I think I've come to to understand why why people are feeling as aggrieved as they are. I think it's because you guys are on tele in our in our lounges in our bedrooms every morning, so we feel like we know you. Like I told you earlier on that I thought you know you came on Sunday, and I went hi Leanne because I thought. Of course I know Leanne. Yeah. And you looked at me like, you said hello, but you looked at me like, okay, who are you? But, and that kind of made me realize that you actually don't know me, but yeah. you know, it feels like, like I know you. And I think it was the same with Vuyo. But anyway, yeah. wearing the family spokesperson hat, yes. the um, funeral is going to be held at nine o'clock at um, St. John's College in Houghton. And um, the entrance to use is off Louis Buerta Avenue. Um, left or right, depending on where you're coming from, uh, you can only turn one way into Elm Street, ELM, and then left into St. David's Road. There'll be ashes to show people where to park on the field, and um, the marquee has been erected on one of the ten on one of the fields, so that's where the service is going to be held. And it'll be followed at West Park Cemetery, where the burial will be. Rowena, thank you. Be strong, and thank you for doing this for the family. You be strong. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I will do. Thank you very, very much. All right, um, in the next hour, we'll be chatting to some of the family members. Nelly uh, Mbuli is his sister. She's here. She'll be talking to us. Tracy Going, also, who started Morning Live with Voyo, is here. She'll also be chatting to us. We're hoping to speak to the children, but um, we'll see how that goes. Let's take a break.